This is my hacked solar powered aquaponic system. Originally I started with these uh, two bins. It's actually one bin. Uh, I was in a cage, cut it in half, flipped the top over, and this was supposed to be a standalone system. Um, and it worked for a little while. Uh, really simple. Um, I have just a few plants in here uh, sitting in uh, cinder. Um, I'm actually not focusing too much on the plants yet. I'm trying to get my system established. But I can uh, definitely grow some things in here. Uh, in here I used to have more fish. Right now I think there's only one tilapia. And I just um, never got around to removing him. Actually I'm going to add some more in here but uh, for now I just wanted to keep this one empty. Um, ever since I added on uh, these two tubs. So this was add-ons. This is my um, added on to the original system. The two tubs you see on the bottom. Two 100 gallon rubber made tubs. Um, this pipe in the middle is overflow going from the two tubs uh, which are joined together and it overflows back into this uh, um, cage tub. And just today I uh, added this uh, makeshift frame and you can see this um, PVC which I'm going to add some uh, net pots to eventually. Um, this is uh, just a test. I wasn't sure if uh, this is going to run properly. You can see um, the water is flowing pretty good in here and probably too much. The water pump I have, have it connected to is a 360 gallon power pump. Um, but I'm going to raise this a little bit. What I'm going to do is add a, another um, grow bed which will be a uh, you know, an ebb and, ebb and flow type. So, um, this PVC will have to sit above that. So I'm hoping that the water flow will cut back just a little bit. Um, I'm trying not to add something like a valve to control the flow. Um, I'm worried about um, clogging and, and other issues. So I'm trying to keep it as simple as possible. Like I said, this is a solar powered system. Uh, completely run off of uh, DC power. The, both the um, the air pump and the two water pumps are uh, DC pumps. Actually, bilge pumps. I, I got them off out of a um, marine supply shop. So this little guy, um, I put together about six months ago. Um, my first attempt. It still works. Um, and currently it's powering powering only one pump. Um, I don't have uh, it connected to anything else. So it just runs during the day. And that's what's actually pumping the water up into the PVC and throughout the system. And this big honking panel I uh, inherited from a friend. It's older technology but uh, it was just sitting in his yard I just asked to borrow it and uh, it works so that's actually um, charging uh, the battery in here I have a deep cycle marine battery it's a 115 amp hour battery and in this container it sits here all, out here all day but in this container I have you can see the charge controller in there which prevents the battery from overcharging and, and discharging at night um, and then the air pump and a whole mess of wires which I will clean up eventually and then in that little container back there I have an Arduino um, it's a uh, I could not find a, a DC powered uh, timer at the time, which I could uh, configure myself. So um, I put together an Arduino, programmed it, and I have it set to um, power this pump. Well, it's not running right now, but there's a separate pump that runs off of that battery, which uh, turns on for three minutes at a time 
and um, every 10 minutes. So on for three, off for 10, and it does that all day and night. Um, and you can see, you know, here, here's some more uh, different view of my plants. Very sparse, I'm uh, gonna eventually grab more plants and put in here and hopefully I can get more started. And then more in this PVC pipe later. But um, in these two tubs, I just have some tilapia. Um, I have only about half a dozen or so, um, but I'll throw more in here eventually when I get this uh, system established actually. So next time, hopefully I'll have this uh, much better rigged and um, hopefully I'll add another grow bed up here. This is why I need this, this frame. Um, I'm gonna see if I can get a bigger um, grow bed.